I'm here on the banks of the River Shore in County Tipperary, uh, just downstream of Ard Finnan. Uh, the issue here is bank erosion. We're going to use what is termed soft engineering methods, which is basically willow weaving, stakes and planting of willows. We're regrading the banks and using uh, an environmental matting. As you can see here, the clay has been falling in. The river is cutting in up here. All this bank has been eroded. The bottom gets eroded and then the top falls down. And all that has an effect on the, the, the fish in the bed of the river. Then at the base of the, the river bank, where the, uh, the bed and the bank meet, we're going to put in Christmas trees. Uh, what we do is we drive stakes into the bank, we secure Christmas trees along the, the base of the bank there using either wire or ties, whatever it takes to secure Christmas trees around those. What will happen then is when silt comes down the river, it will trap in these Christmas trees and the, the, back, the bank will actually uh, start building up again. On the stakes we've used to hold those Christmas trees in place, we will actually weave some willows. These will actually sprout as well and you'll get a growth of, of uh, willows. This is our geomatting along that. Uh, this will actually tie in the, the soil particles together to stop further erosion. As this develops, what we're going to get is you know, plants establishing um, like there's uh, reed canary grass, even a little bit of it there at the moment. Similar vegetation as to what we have over on the far bank over there, you have probably water mint, um, schools watercress, and uh, some other you know, typical bankside vegetation, brook lime, that, that type of thing, will come in you know, along where this bare soil is. Then up beyond it, uh, it will be more the typical um, uh, terrestrial vegetation, uh, will come in with grasses and uh, the you know, small herbaceous plants. The banks of the river shore downstream of Art Finnan, and this is a section of river that has been completed last year. This was done around last um, August and September. And again, just to point out to you, what we have down here is a Christmas tree. It's obviously, it's obviously has been decaying over the winter, but it's still in place. Right? And what happens there is that will gather and, and contain the silt. You'll also see the stakes along here, about 18 inches apart. What happens with these is these were driven down as far as we could go with them. The Christmas tree is actually secured to those. And then between those we have willow sticks, similar to this one here, although probably a little, a little heavier than that. And they are weaved in and out through those. And that comes up for approximately one metre. Then you'll see the bank is sloped at an angle back up here. And what we have in this is just underneath that grass and seedlings there we have the geomat that's biodegradable and we have reseeded that, right? And then we come along and we put these slips in. This slip was actually put in last September and it's taller than I am now. So the root system that, that is generated from all these slips up along and all this was done and you can see it, it's, um, it's the middle of April now and these are budding quite well and the root system that's taken over here was consolidated here and we should have no more erosion here. And this is following um, the floods of 2015, which were probably the, the biggest floods in this area in 10 years. So these were done uh, last September and they have withstood the, the, all the winter floods and they're still in place and budding now. So we can imagine what this will be like in one or two years time with the root system, the biodegradable matting should be gone but all the weeds and plants and everything will have taken over and we're back to mother nature again As you work perfectly, as you can see here that, that survived the, the, the flood of 2015 which is the worst flood, one of the worst floods on record and there's no erosion here down and the bridge all around the bridge to stay completely solid as well